my gosh, I've never seen anything like that. Jeez. Whoa. Look at lifting everything up. Uh, Fort McMurray, Alberta, Canada. You remember the huge fire there? Over 80,000 people have been evacuated. The update on the fire right now is that it's moving south, so it's outside of the city. But the problem is people can't come back until it's safe and workers have been able to check out the power and water supplies. Uh, this fire has burned close to 2,500 homes and buildings. state of emergency is now in effect for the Amur region of Russia. This is in eastern Russia. The fire's grown big enough that you can see a huge smoke plume from space. It's that brown looking stuff, not quite as white as the clouds. Uh, nearly 25,000 acres scorched in a matter of 24 hours. humongous tire fire that's going on on the outskirts of Madrid. You know, you look at that fire, you can tell right away that's not trees burning and there's definitely something else. And as I said, it's tires that could actually take a couple of days to put this fire out. And, you know, officials up there are thinking that it was actually started deliberately. Southern California beaches have been painted red with an invasion of crabs. Thousands of vibrant red tuna crabs swarmed Huntington and Imperial Beach on Wednesday, May 11th. The tuna or pelagic crab kind of resembles a small lobster and is usually about one to three inches long. They're called tuna crabs because tunas like to eat them. And the fact that they're taking over Southern California beaches is a little strange. This actually happened last June, but in way bigger numbers. And local authorities said it was the first time in 34 years that people had seen them in the area. Coming up, an image so controversial, West Point Academy has launched an investigation into the possible motivation behind it and some damage control. It's hard to see, but the sky is orangish, orange-ish, and it was a double rainbow earlier, and it is 
Um, it's 8.15 right now, and it, there's just been lightning. What is up with the weird weather in Texas?